fantastic book about exercises which sublimate any anger or anxiety you may be feeling by using the natural world as a kind of lesson. Invoking transformational metaphors for the new dawn of the warrior. Aha, uh -huh, you've read it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't really like his stuff. Right. Really? I mean, no judgment intended. Subjective viewpoint. It's called the blue whale anyway and the idea is that instead of um, tensing your body in moments of stress moments <laughs> all right uh, periods of stress instead of tensing you exhale uh, like this It's been really helpful to me this last week. It's literally like letting off steam. Hello? Ah, fantastic. Hello, sorry. I got delayed at the psychosynthesis centre. Hi, Dan Hoss. I'm Ralph. Christopher. Hanny. Christopher Hanny, right. Sorry, have we started an exercise or something? No, no, you said you might be a bit late, so we've just been there. Chatting. Ah. Right, well, I'll, I'll start. Shall I? Mm. It's good to have all five of us here. At last. Managed to avoid the massage parlours this week. But I still found myself being drawn to seeking out porn on my laptop. Found this site, it's a bit cartoony really, where you operate this prick with the mouse and you, you move it onto different parts of this naked woman and... Uh, uh, different parts? Sorry. It's all right. Anyway, Thing is, I must have had it on a bit loud. And suddenly there's this banging on the walls from next door. It's never happened before. I was paralyzed with embarrassment. And I, I tried to shut the thing down and I, I knocked the mouse, which knocked the woman, well, so to speak, not woman. Sort of cyber woman. Yeah, cy cyber woman. And she got much louder and, and orgasmic and and I tried to turn the thing down and the laptop fell off the bed and uh, broke somehow, which is why I didn't get your mail about the spirit and sex seminar. Ah. But anyway, it's, uh, it's being fixed now. I didn't think I'd miss it. But now I find I need it for my UKMM work and it is a stop. Sorry, right. UKMM is is what? Sorry. United Kingdom Men's Movement. Right. Uh, Very active. It's got a good site. Yeah. Oz is their tech guy. Mm. Sorry, Dan. Now, I suppose I'm just haunted by my compulsive need for sex. And I'm already feeling that me saying this is overbalancing the potential for this group. Uh, what I'm saying is it's it's too hard, it's, it's no, too no, intense. No, 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 not for me. No, no. 
Yes, that's right. Well, I mean, no, it's fine. It's an open forum, mate. No judgment. Well, maybe I need some judgment. Maybe I need to feel more ashamed, Oz. No, no, whoa. I've been on retreats before and you've spoken openly. Not, not about this. No, I've, got, I've got this voice in my head that keeps saying, you're, you're talking crap, you, you're lying. You're pretending. I know that voice. I've got the same one. Sort of... No. Uh, yeah? Can I ask, I know I did it just now, but are, are we um, interjecting in, e in each other's shares now, or...? Well... Well, I don't know if you laid down any ground rules last week, but I guess it's a movable feast, and... Uh... Well, we, did, we just, we, did, we didn't do that last week. Right. Well, each to his own, I suppose, up to the sharer's needs. Um, you know, Dan put something to the group there, and it, you know, it needed dealing with, and so... You're right, Dan. Sorry, no, I just need something to push against, something, something physical. I know the feeling. Come on. Do you want to grab my hand? <coughs> oh, sumo star. <coughs> <coughs> Stronger than he looks. Hey, we wash each other, right? Yeah. Oh. Well. Uh, that's me, Dan. Well, in truth, what's that? Kids. Oh my God! Did I do that? No, it doesn't matter. I am so sorry. Forget about it. It's fine. About your sex thing. Addiction? Sorry, addiction, yeah. Have you tried talking to your penis? Uh, not, not recently, no. You get neck ache, surely. Depends on the length of the penis conversation. I've been reading about the penis, actually, in a book called Head, Heart and Penis, Poetical Reflections on the Eternal Triangle of Male Sexual Fears. Right. There's an exercise whereby you ask your penis questions. You don't literally have to talk to your penis. Oh, thank God. But you can use uh, an inanimate object, like uh, uh, this cushion. Right. Do you want to try it? Hmm. Now what? Ask it a question. I'll do the voice if you like. Okay. Hello? Hello? Oh, no. How are you? Sore, worn out, but you know all about that. You? Sad. That's not how you were last time we met. Oh, no. Don't you remember? What occasion are you talking about? I can't remember. There have been so many. Are you doing... Yoda? I'm sorry, I'm not very comfortable with this at all. No? No. Did you? Um, yeah, that feels a bit weird, honey. Really? 
Is it the voice? The voice, the cushion, all of it. Oh. This thing, it, it has uh, no pomposity about it. Well, to carry on from our last session, really, I've been increasingly frustrated with my place in the church. Um, not, not wearing a collar away from the church anymore. My parishioners irritate me. Uh, my volunteers don't seem to be able to move without a yay or a nay from me. I mean, I, I, I delegate till I'm blue in the face, but, oh, no, they need a, a, a father figure, a cuddly daddy to, to wipe their asses for them. Well, it's, it's not me, dear. <laughs> Stupid questions like, um, how long did St Paul's letter to the Corinthians take to get to the Corinthians? I, it tires me and it makes me eat too much. Eat and eat, 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 eat. Last weekend at a church gala, I ate four portions of sherry trifle. Four. I was up all night with indigestion. And of course, it's, it's at night I, I realize that uh, it's my unfulfilled needs that are at the heart of it all. And that's not them. I'm, in, I'm no longer with Judith now. It was mutual, but uh, five-year-old sexless relationship. What? Sorry? Who had this sexual relationship with a five-year-old? No one. He, Jesus. Who? Hey? He, the, um... I, I, I said that my relationship with my friend Judith had finished after five years. Oh, sorry. I must have dropped off. Apologies. Carry on. Jesus. A a anyway, um, she's moved away. Back to East Bradenham. We were both tired of rolling about on beds with our clothes still on. Wondering what we were doing. What God thought of it all. <laughs> 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 I don't have anybody to identify with, I suppose, and that makes me feel very lonely. Very alone. Hmm. <laughs> I'm all right. <sighs> so I'm all right, I'm all right. You sure? Yes. Oh dear. Sorry. Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god! Right. Facts. Who the hell is making all that background? Can't you see we're trying to have a meeting? Come on, answer me. I asked you a question. It wasn't me. Yes, it was. You said let's kick the ball really hard. Listen, I don't want to hear your porky pies. Now just piss off and go and play somewhere else. He's being a bit harsh, isn't he? Well, they're his kids, so... What? So shouldn't this be a point for discussion? Sorry about that, everyone. What is that? It's an anti-stress exercise. Right. It's called the blue whale. Well, could you save it, do you think? Save the whale? 